Hello, my name is Liesl. Today, I'm going to show you how to curve your text in Canva so that you can write in a circle or make a round badge or logo. And as a bonus, I will show you a fun animation to make your words go round. So if this is what you're looking for, come with me. To start with our curved designs, I've opened a canvas and I've colored the background green. Now I will go to text and add my text. Let's update the color and the font. So now I want to curve this text, okay? So click on your text. Go to Effects, scroll down, go to Shape. So now there is no shape, or you can choose the curved shape, okay? So click onto that, and when you scroll down, you will see on the sliding scale, you can exaggerate your curve, okay? And this is where the fun begins. You will just have to play around until it fits into the shape. So for example, if you wanted to have a half moon or if you wanted to have a full circle, there you go. Then you can further manipulate this by going to spacing and then you can also space your letters, okay? So say for example, you wanted a little bit more space between your letters, you will drag it there and then you can go back to your curve and play around until it's just right. Now in our first example, all the words were in one line and went around, okay? But you might want the two words to curve separately. So I've got two words here. Now to help us guide our text, let's add a circle. Okay, so we will go to elements, search circle. I will choose a circle under shapes. Let's make it as big as we want it to be. Just want to change the color. Okay. There it's in the center. So let's start with the first word, absolutely. So you click on the word, go to effect, scroll down to shape, click on to curve. And now we can make it just as in the previous one, I want to go and space my letters a bit. And then I'll go back here. Okay, you can also drag these corners to make your word fit better. Okay, good, that looks good. Now we will go to Fabulous. In Effects, go down to Curve. But this time you wanted to curve in the opposite direction. So now we will go back to the left. Can you see what happens? There you go. Let's add some space between our letters. Let's go back to our curve. Drag the corners a bit. And place it. So now you can see absolutely fabulous and it's much easier to read. Now it wouldn't be Canva if there's not another shortcut available. So what you can do is you can go up here to design, search anything round like logo templates or badges. So say round badge. And if you go here under templates, you will see quite a few pre-made badges and logos already. And all of them have got the rounded text in so you can just choose one that you like and update accordingly. Now let's do a little animation. So this is a design that I found on Canva, which I've updated. And it says, let's go round, wreaths and flowers. Okay, so I want this, let's go round, these two little dots and the wreaths and flowers to go in a circle. So I've selected these four items. I'm going to group it. Now I'm going to go to animate. I'm going to scroll down 
to add motion effects and I'm going to click on rotate. If you're on Canva Pro you can also change the speed so make it slower or really fast. Ooh, okay. And just because this is so much fun, let's create another animation. So I use the same template as here. I've updated again and it says now another round, coffee and good times. And I want to animate the coffee and good times. So let's click on there, click on the more button, go to animate, go down and in the typewriter animation. So we will click on there. Again, this is your normal speed, but if you're on Canva Pro, you can either make it faster or slower, but I think it's perfect as it is. Now, to be able to use your designs, you will have to download them, okay? But each one of them will be a little bit different. So, for example, if we look at this first one, you can just go to Share, Download, and then either choose a JPEG or a PNG. There's no movement or animation in there, so that would be fine. On this design, if you only want to download the round circle with the words in it, but not the background, then you will have to choose a PNG with a transparent background. Now on Canva Pro, you do have the transparent background option, but you don't have it on the free version. But not to worry, you can use this tool for free. Let's have a look at the next one. So now our animations. So to download this animation, you will go to Share, Download. You can choose to either do it as an MP4 video or as a GIF. Remember to unclick all pages there and only choose the page that you would like to download. And the same will be for this one with a little typewriter animation. So we will go again to Share. Download, GIF, unclick and only choose the page that you want. I hope you found this helpful today. I hope you learned something new. If you've got any questions, please leave me a comment. And thank you so much for staying until the end. See you next time. Bye bye.